Okay, Virgos, welcome back to your weekly reading. Love, career, family, and friends. Okay, we already have cards flying out. We have Queen of Swords reversed for your love life. Divine Spirit, Holy Spirit, what else is going on in Virgo's love life? The High Priestess. Someone could be pissed off and not saying anything. King of Cups. Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio energy. High Priestess, Pisces energy. With the Queen of Swords reversed, it's like someone could be doing something very underhanded, secretly manipulative. Someone is being very manipulative. Why is the Queen of Swords reversed? Page of Wands. Yeah, they could be gossiping or talking too much. Maybe telling y'all's business to somebody in your, in your love life. I don't know. Someone is not to be trusted. Why is the High Priestess here? The Devil Energy. See, your intuition is telling you that someone could be toxic. Could be dealing with the Capricorn. Why is the King of Cups here? Hangman. See, someone's... Someone's emotions is stuck. It's like you need to look at something differently. Look at something different, okay? Maybe it's a good idea to be single. Someone also could be very obsessed with you at this time and not telling you. For, for others of you, if it's not that first story, it's the second story. It's like someone very obsessed with you but not saying anything. Opportunity is the advice card. There's going to be an opportunity to maybe speak to this person or someone needs to take the opportunity to say something, say what they need to say, okay? Alrighty, what's going on with Virgos in their career? Three cards, please, for your career. Two of Swords, okay? A decision needs to be made. Maybe you feel irritated with the Nine of Wands coming out. And then Four of Swords, someone doesn't want to deal with this. Maybe you need to take a break. Maybe you're just feeling irritated, okay, when it comes to your career. Why is the Two of Swords here? Ten of, of Swords. Yeah, unsure if you, you need to end something. Unsure of how you feel when it comes to your career. Why is the Nine of Wands here for Virgos in their career? The Knight of Wands. Knight of Wands. So there's could be this energy of you feel all over the place or maybe someone at your job is very irritating or annoying to you why the four swords the death card yeah you, okay you could want something to end it's like i want this to be over i'm over it death card four of swords i don't want to talk i just want this to be over i feel like running away some of you want your career um meaning your job or what you do for work you Maybe you don't find fulfillment in it anymore, okay? What's the advice for Virgo's career? Communicate clearly, yeah. So instead of just walking away or feeling indecisive, maybe you are uh, worried about hurting somebody's feelings, you need to communicate clearly. Tell people how you feel, okay? If you're irritated on your job, you need to let somebody know. Or if you feel like you need to uh, tell them the truth about something, go ahead and say it. What's going on with Virgos and their family? Remember, your family can be your spouse, so love messages may come through. Three of Wands, Virgos and their family. Oh, it's like, okay. You may be waiting for something to get better. Better, sorry. Something with a home situation may be blowing up with the Tower card coming out. Page of Wands, maybe needing to go in a new direction or someone needs to communicate something. When it comes to you and your family, why is the Three of Wands here for Virgo and their family? Nine of Cups. Maybe you want to stay away. <laughs> it's like, oh, I got to get out of here. I need to get out of here. Why is the Tower card here for Virgos and their family? Will of Fortune wanting to move away, move on, move to something better? Why is the Page of Wands here for Virgos and their family? Four of Pentacles. Uh, you may feel held back. You may feel like someone is holding you back. You may feel stuck in a situation, mm -hmm. wanting things to get better, wanting to feel happier. Why or what is the advice rather in this situation for Virgos? It's up to you. Yeah, it's up to you. Maybe you need to say something. Like I said with the page of wands, maybe you need to say something, but it's up to you if you want to continue to deal with this situation going on with you and your family this week. I feel like a lot of drama is happening. A lot of arguments, maybe. 
Okay, what's going on with you and your friends? Virgos and their friends. Well, Queen of Swords upright this time. We have the Star card. Yeah, Aquarius energy is coming through. And we have Temperance. Sagittarius energy is coming through. You have friends with those sun signs. It's almost like someone comes in and tells you something or someone needs to communicate. Someone says they need to, like, maybe they need healing for something. Maybe you need to give your attention to a situation with your friends that, that requires a lot of patience. Why is the Queen of Swords here for Virgos and their friends? Yeah, maybe the two of you or the groups, the group of you, maybe you and two friends meet up and someone tells you something. Why is the star card here? Seven of Pentacles. Maybe some your attention needs to be brought to something that happened in the past with the Seven of Pentacles energy. It could be something um, about money as well. Um, not that someone owes you or you owe them. I'm feeling like maybe it's a good investment. Maybe there's a business plan. I also feel like you need to talk to your friends maybe about something that you're dealing with or that you're going through. Why is temperance here? Six of Wands. You're going to have victory and success. I feel like this will be a successful conversation. I feel like when the two of you or three of you come together, there's going to be something talked about um, when it comes to maybe a situation that you invested in, maybe invested emotions in. Yeah, maybe there's been a lot of things done in the dark. Maybe you've been dealing with emotions on your own, dealing with something on your own, and maybe you need to talk about it or your friends need to talk about it. But the conversation ends up good. Yeah, be assertive. Yeah, talk it out. Go ahead and talk it out and don't be afraid. Alrighty, Virgos, that is your energy for this week. Don't forget to like this video. Give me a thumbs up. Also, share this video and subscribe to my channel, Sophia Monetero. I look forward to hearing from you. Have a great week. Take care. Bye.